Samantha Ruth Prabhu. 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 She's a Samantha. She's Ruth Prabhu. Samantha, Samantha, Samantha. Samantha Ruth Prabhu. Samantha, Samantha, Samantha. Samantha Ruth Prabhu. Samantha Ruth Prabhu. Not end well. Hey, welcome back to our stupid directions of Corbin. I'm Samantha Ruth Prabhu. Incorrect. And you can follow us on Instagram and Twitter. Instagram content. Oh! That's his orgasm noise. Yep. Uh, Every time. <laughs> At least you get a good laugh in. Uh, and uh, subscribe if you haven't hit the like button. That would suck to have laughter be your climax sound. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was a good one. Thanks. <laughs> I have practice. Uh, what are we doing? Today we got a new trailer that just dropped. Is it, does it have a Samantha Ruth Prabhu? No. Do, do, well, the reason we did that. that is because the one we just did had yeah, her yeah, in it. So yeah, you guys what do you saw care? it already. You don't, don't know. Worry. Anyways, uh, this we came to this morning to watch the KRK um, a trailer. Um, that dropped without that, subs. That dropped without subs, so we had to wait. But then apparently, like 30 minutes after that, the new CBI-5, uh, which, as you guessed correctly, I don't know if. It is the fifth. You. It's the fifth. Ah, uh, no one told me. Oh, but the, they may have told me. I just I wasn't looking. Yeah. So, um, but yeah, it's the fifth of of this Got iconic it. kind of series. Great. That it apparently is all done by one director. He's in all of them. It's kind of a cool. an iconic series of his. Great. Um, like an MI an MI series. So you guys can tell us if if this is a series we should. I'm assuming it's not. And gonna, again, yeah, like if it's a standalone thing where you don't have to see the others. Yeah, I'm assuming it's not going to spoil anything. Obviously. People say, oh, well, you know he doesn't die. I know Tom Cruise is not going to die in Mission Impossible. It's just like James it's, Bond. Uh, it's James Bond's not going to, until, like, unless you know it's, like, their last film. Right. They might die. Yeah, if it's the character portraying them in their last one, it, it you, might. You, you then, know, but, like, whatever. It, if it's an iconic action series, I just figure the, the lead star's not going to die. That's yeah. just not how people make films. That's typically, uh, <laughs> you know, like, it's called John Wick. If he dies, you can't call it John Wick anymore. So... <laughs> John Wick adjacent. <laughs> <laughs> That's the, that, all the ones after him are good. Although they did that with Bourne. They kind of did that with Bourne. I've never seen Bourne. You haven't seen any of the Bournes? No. Good. Yeah, I know. Yeah. It's one of the series that I've never seen yeah. before. No, they're good. Uh, anyways, so yeah. We, Brian th that, Cox is in the first one. You man. guys can tell us if that's one of the... Uh, I, I'm Moody is uh, is one of the actors that we need to explore a lot of um, because we've only seen, I think, two of his films, I think, right? Two? Yes. It's Barangoo. You're going to ask me? Yeah, and then... There was another one, right? Yeah, I can't remember. Was he in Irovar? Irovar? No. Was he? No. I don't remember. No. Anyways, it was very little, and he has like probably over 100 credits or 200 or something. 200,000. Like Lara. I think that was Leland. In the way, Angle Kana, right? In the end of the end of the period, Sandy and the Pindima. Hey, yep, he's in everything, everything, man. You know, sir, it's highly corrupt. He's three Kalam Raya. Demand and 
Oh, I thought there was going to be more. Um, shout out to the music people. Yeah. I love the music in that. I agree. Yeah, the, the overall trailer, maybe it's just because we haven't seen any of the other ones. It just kind of fell almost flat for me a little bit. It did. I was just going to say, I'm like, I, because remember, this is reactions. So we react honestly the way we see it. It's nothing personal against anyone. It's just the reaction of the moment. And my reaction to that was, huh, I bet if you knew the franchise, maybe, yeah, you would understand every little nuance of this that's going to be giving you yeah, yeah, yeah. what you expect for a standalone thing I'm not exposed to. I agree. For yeah, me, yeah, it, was it, like, kind of, it was like, eh. Yeah, it was kind of just looked like a crime drama. With, yeah, with uh, the, that at first I was engaged because I thought it was going to be a little dark and then it got kind of campy and I thought, yeah. okay, is this going to go Pink Panther? Is it going to go Clue? Maybe it's none of the above? Yeah. But uh, either way, there was just nothing in it that got, had me like fully engaged. Yeah, obviously, the, the music did. Obviously, uh, I mean, if it's a continuation, and and you guys can tell us if like this series is like one that's one we should watch. Obviously, we would start with the first one. No, we wouldn't yeah. have to hop into the fifth one. That's, Unless you say it's okay to do that, because yeah. I would tell people with MI, you can, you can jump. Yeah, but you can would jump you say in. that though? You wouldn't. I don't think you would. I would, I you would, would be like for the new release. Like if someone said to me the next Mission Impossible, I would say if you can at least watch these two before you go in. But if you don't, it's no big deal. Still go see it. Hmm. Yeah. You don't. Ha- it's like the Bond films. You don't have to see another Bond film before you go see another Bond film. I feel like you should. Nah. I feel like you should. Why? All you need to know is he likes his martinis shaken, not stirred, and his name is Bond, James Bond. He's 007. He has a different Bond girl every time. He's going to have awesome trinkets and gadgets, and he's going to get the bad guy. And the girl. And great clothes. And there's always boobs in the intro. There's always naked women in the intro. You know that? Shadowy naked women. You know that? Oh, yeah. It's like a, it's like a staple. There's yeah. a shadowy naked woman in the intro of, like when they do the big, the song, the Bond song. There's always a woman's breasts. Breast goat. Because Bond, Bond, Bond loves Bond women. Goes. Like that? Yep. Uh, there's always a, a breasticle. If you called my phone right now, you know what it would ring? Why? You're showing your age. How dare you have your sound on? <laughs> no, I, people of my generation no, it's never. On, it's on ringtone. It's on sh- vibrate. Yeah. And people of my generation do n- never turn on the sound. Ever. That's a cardinal sin. Tell, tell me I'm wrong. I am not wrong. So that's nice to know that if I call you and you don't answer, it's because you're not paying attention. You don't care about people calling you. I hope you miss a really important call. No, no, you're you're misunderstanding. I'm saying the sound part. I have vibration. <laughs> it's just we don't. What does that mean for you? If your phone I is, I, is on the couch and I, you're in the kitchen and someone calls you, you can't hear it because your sound isn't on. Yeah. Yeah, that shows you what you feel about people trying to reach you. Oh, I don't want them to. I know. I hope you miss <laughs> an important call. <laughs> you know what I'll do? I'll call them back. <laughs> Yeah, we'll see. The generational gaps are fun. <laughs> Missed opportunities are fun. No. Oh, yeah. I never had an opportunity that's just like, you missed my call, you don't get it now. You Yet. call me back five minutes. Yet. What, what the, what's the opportunity I'm going to miss? Tell me. There are a lot of... Uh, there are a lot of people with Shabu a lot Khan, of regrets Khan calls me. because they missed a call. I'm here for five minutes, man. You need to get over here. Just telling you, <laughs> there's people with lots of regrets because they missed a call. Well, not, I'm sure your wife feels really encouraged to know that if she's ever out and about and she can't reach you, it's probably because you didn't have the ringer on. That's great to know. I, I promise you, if you ask my wife right now, she does not have her ringer on. And it's not because of the reason you're thinking it's because we don't want anybody else to know that somebody's calling us why i don't want you in my business <laughs> you who gives i don't give a crap who knows my phone's ringing yeah i don't want you i don't want you. and also you if, you really are like i don't want you knowing i'm getting a phone call one people don't call me Rick. don't ever call me i'll block you don't call me 
What do you say whenever I call you? Why are you calling me? Every right, but time. I answer because I got a ringtone. Vibration works just as well. You know what else vibration works for, kids? Ask Rick's mom. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, yeah. So you guys can let us know uh, what uh, what you think about the trailer. Yeah. And uh, is this a series of Mamoodies we should explore? And also... Do you like get into Mamoudi himself. Yeah, and if you're if you're a fan of the series, do you like the trailer? Are you excited? Yeah, please let us know. Yeah, down below.